Hey guys, we're back. Hi, hi, hi. Hi. As always, I'm Phil. And I'm Parrish. Um. I'm not always Parrish, though. Sometimes I'm somebody different. It's, it's true. Depends on if I took my meds. <laughs> yeah. That is very true. Look, his skull's still here. Yeah. Makes me happy. It's not reanimating. That's always good. Yeah. Like, when it first comes back there and it's like boss music starts playing again and you're like oh god what what is happening what why have you done this to me it's like what what, what? oh yeah thank goodness i can refill here the pipe plenty it's really you need like energy and missiles and everything yep well, and like, I don't think there's a recharge station around here. I'm probably forgetting that there is one, and I'm just dumb, but... This, this works. Just as well. Alright, so... Oh! And I... Of course. And then a safe spot. Always be saving. Yes. ABS. I mean... Yeah. I was about to go with IBS, because like, wait, that's two colors. <laughs> so, you know, obviously we don't have the grapple beam yet, and this thing, like, falls as you're on it, but you can grapple off that dude to get up to the... Off the dude? Yeah. That sounds annoying. Shit. So much I timing. I have done that. Oh, uh, we can't point in every turn, bro. Yeah, pretty much. That's okay. Whatever. Acid. Strain in. Oh. Yeah. More missiles. Mm, missiles. I think I have forty five now. Of course. God damn it. <laughs> god. Oh my god, it hurts. It hurts so bad. What are you doing? Refilling before I have to run back and screw myself up again. Because, hey kids, let's watch a guy suck at this game. Yay! Right up to the precipice. <laughs> On the precipice of darkness. It's a Finn arcade game. It's a lot of fun. On the rain slick. On the rain slick. Uh, precipice of darkness. I think that's the name. Epic name. Yeah. For a lot. Uh, for the the game itself is actually a lot of fun too. All right. So we got all this schmigma. On the way. I can't remember if I can. Yep. I gotta have super bombs before I can blow this up. And. I don't think I can get super bombs right now. Maybe I'm. Maybe I just have to roll through and do it. What are we trying to do? Uh, we have to. Get all of this stuff out of the way. Yeah, I gotta go over here, get the super bombs. Well, at least the super bombs are here. Yeah. Seems weird for them to be though. Like. Oh shit. Did you need grapple thingy? Well. And I. Like, I'm not. I'm completely fucking forgetting what I'm doing, right? I think right now, and so normally, like, what I would do is just when I'm not sure about something, I just re-jump through an area mm -hmm. and go, yeah. But like, what you're supposed to do here is they run super fast and everything breaks. Yeah, and then you make a big jump. And you're a hero. You don't suck. Just juggernaut your way through it. Yeah, pretty much. I'm the juggernaut, bitch. 
but I can't remember at all like where I'm going. This is great. You jump down. I jump down. And then you can't get up again. So they're pretty much gonna keep you down the whole time. If I could wall jump better, I could get back up, but Maybe we can get the super super boots. Wow. No, there's no such thing. Oh, yeah. Keep feeling like there's just upgrades aplenty everywhere. Yeah, uh, and to be honest with you, like, I'm doing a lot better than I normally do. Uh, normally, like, I've gotten to the, I've gotten to this, like, point in the game where I'm just like, fuck, I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I don't even remember where I am. And where the fuck am I going? And I feel like we're going to title this episode, the episode in which nothing happens. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. I mean, I, I guess that's fair, but I don't know. Like, I I know that there has to be something for us to do, but it's just not coming. No. So I feel like the game's not gonna force you to be somewhere that you can't be without the shit that you need, would it? No, it doesn't normally. But like, the game's usually really good about that. But I'm pretty sure that I jumped down there when I wasn't supposed to. And then I saved. And like, I feel like I've missed something, but I can't remember what I missed. And so I'm just kinda like, shit, what do I do? Cause like, I know that that jump that I'm supposed to make, mm -hmm. I'm supposed to end up there. And I just, like it. I supposed to do. I know I was supposed to kill Brockemeyer, and I know that that was supposed to get me, you know, to a point, and then I was supposed to be able to go from there. And I just, I know what what the comments are gonna be like. God, this guy sucks at this game. Somebody get a better guy playing. Uh, the, don't look at me. I don't know what the hell's going on. That's okay. I mean, that, that's pretty much like that sums up your life there, Parish. Pretty much. Is that why you will always be working for other people? I always be working for other people. Shit. It's just simpler that way. Oh. Alright, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna. Come on. Come on. Like, I want to believe that there's something I can get over here that I'm forgetting, but I'm probably crazy. What's going to really piss me off is if it was just like as simple as, there's something right over there, dumbass. You dumbass. He's dead. Okay, so that that was the last guy, the crocodile looking dude. Yeah, that's why he's called the crocodile. Yeah, we might be looking at a fact. Oh, I'm already on it. Oh, <laughs> Okay. Um, yeah. Literally the episode in which nothing happened. Christ. Because this, like, I think we're we're hitting the ten minute mark right now. We hit the wall. It was bound to happen. Like we were going at a pretty quick clip on this game. Oh, there you go. Oh, unfortunately, you did it on the wrong side. When I knew I was on the wrong side, but I thought that there might be a lip that I could, like, stop on. Shit. Alright. Shit. I was there. You were there, man. Uh, 
I've never been good at wall jumping. Like, comparatively, like, speedrunners and shit. Oh my god. I mean, you can hear the controller that badly. I feel like it, uh, that's half the battle there. Maybe. Uh, I think you're being too nice to me. Bah. Like, there's a speedrunner that I watch called Gerard the Completionist. Mm -hmm. And. Let me guess, he always finishes his game? Well, the, like, the whole idea is that he plays a new game every week for the show and finishes it completely. Like, I just. I, I, one, I don't have time, I have children. <laughs> but, um. Like, that, that's. When him and, like, he plays a game, he sits on the couch and plays games with his buddy named Alex. And, uh, Alex and him, like, they, uh, they have stuff like, you know, save constantly. And when you do stupid shit like this, it's like, you, you gotta learn from your mistakes, so you gotta fix them. But yeah, um, that's gonna end it for this episode, because, yeah. Uh, I promise, we will figure out what the hell we need to do and uh you know try to not suck i may have found it so okay you may see us on the other side of this ledge for the next episode oh thank goodness so we shall see you again bye sorry okay so it says it is the easiest thing in the world when you know how okay yeah. dick uh do not use the shine spark maneuver to launch yourself diagonally. Instead, just gather speed by running from left right to left. And when you step on the tilted ramp, press and hold the jump button while holding left on the D-pad. You will make yeah. a huge jump all the way to the door on the opposite side of the room. But I gotta have the, the fucking bomb to be able to clear out the path so I can get the speed. You're not using the... Isn't that what the shine spark maneuver is when you're going too fast? No, shine spark is when you, you stop and you drop down and hold the speed into your system mm -hmm. and then what it does is it allows you to uh, it lets you do a special jump but yeah I know what he's talking about but like the problem is, is that I can't destroy the rocks down here to because I'm supposed to have a super bomb to destroy the rocks with Cause I see that just stuck in no I mean, this is apparently a thing. Yeah, it is. It's a thing. I've done it before. It's... Looks like you have to go back up then. Yeah. So you have to wall slash bomb jump. I can't bomb jump. Okay. Of course I saved when I was down there. Fuck it. So, to wall jump, mm -hmm. you have to get next to the wall, mm -hmm. be spinning, and click the A button, but not, not too much, or else you'll jump out of your spin. <laughs> and then, if you... Shit. You use the momentum that you get from wall jumping to jump out, then to jump up from there. And you'll notice how she kind of changes her position when you are, are about to be able to jump off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You're doing it so well earlier. Yeah, like, as soon as it, it matters, like, it's just nope. Oh my god. This 
that's the only thing we gotta do is just get up there. So... You, you see that I can do this. Mm -hmm. It's just... It's the mental block, I think. <laughs> oh, I want to do a supercut of this, kind of. But at the same time, it's just fucking pathetic to watch. tutorial about wall jumping but I've never understood how to do it right so 